guys and welcome to my channel my name is cello the fashion fairy if you're stopping by for the first time thank you please consider joining the diy farm by clicking on the subscribe button and don't forget to click on the notification bell to get notified whenever i have a new tutorial on this channel we post new videos twice a week and we do pattern drafting we share fashion tips and tricks and we also help you grow your fashion business and give you tips on how to create amazing styles keep watching and see you in my tutorial in today's tutorial i'll be showing you guys how to extend your basic bodice pattern this is necessary if you want to make a top and we'll also show you what to do if you want to add a peplum to this pattern so these are my usual team players for this pattern drafting if you've not watched our video on the basic bodice pattern please click on a pause and go back and watch it so that you understand what we are doing right now so here we're just going to mark whatever we have on this construction line which we got from dividing our bust measurement plus ease and we're going to extend this line all the way down to where we want our top to sit and we're just going to connect the two points remember to measure the circumference of wherever you want the top to sit and what we have as this measurement for this pattern is 40 inches so here we have half inch and we're just going to blend it into the pattern in order to avoid any zipper bulge so we're marking our hip line at this moment and we're, we're working with a hip of 40 like i said and we're dividing that by four and whatever we have at this point we're going to add half inch of ease to it so that's what i'm measuring at this point 40 divided by four plus half inch that's ten and a half we're connecting that to the hip line don't forget to eliminate any sharp points at this point don't mind that it's going into the next pattern guys you're going to use a tracing wheel to trace it out on your fabric before you cut and add your measurements so I'm measuring whatever I have as my dart construction line and I'm marking it all the way down and I'm going to extend this line I'm going to mark it straight down to meet that point on my hip line I'm doing this so I can extend the dart, eliminate any excess at this point. If you're still here guys, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, click on the notification bell to get notified whenever I have new tutorials. So from the hip point, we're marking 2 inches upwards to extend the dart lines to this point. We're also going to show you what to do if you want to cut this pattern into two in order to add your peplum or whatever you want to add maybe your skirt pattern to it to form a dress so you're marking half inch from the waistline and you're connecting it all the way to the back that just the first that leg as you can see so here guys we are done with today's tutorial i hope you were able to pick one or two things from this tutorial thank you for being here and please watch out for my next video i would love to see you again bye